Uh, team A came up out of nowhere. I should have been watching. Oh my god. They rotated up behind Team G, who was already hurt. Dude. Hey, get your shield up. You haven't fought anybody else yet. You should be full. Drink some sodas. You should have sodas, not shakers. I'm sure you would rather have a man. Oh my god, that was a Sammy! That's that's my girl. Beautiful grenade. Great damn work. Oh my god, who is this girl? Who is this girl? I don't know who that is. Cause that's not the Sammy I used to play with. What the fuck? Go the RFB! But oh no! Showtime! Harpy with the matadors! Harpy kicking ass with the matadors! Beautiful work with the Matadors. Beautiful clutch by Harpy. Great work. Oh, the Kronos goes in. Shoot him. Oh, no, but he's getting shot by Shay. Now he's in trouble because she's got Matadors. Good backup. Showtime. Showtime saved his life. Great job, Showtime. Oh, no. P Sammy with her P90. But Fuse comes up in the back with the DT. Fuse has been killing it with the DT today. Good grenade. Oh, M60! So dang close! Very nice try, Showtime. Oh, good shot with the RFB, Loki. Yep, good pressure from PMF. You know, I don't know if that was intentional. They rotate around these buildings. For example, they had one guy on this building and the other two over there. I don't know if it was intentional, but if it was, that was brilliant. M60 is gonna take him down. Good M60ing! Showtime kicking butt with the M60 in this game. Now we got Fuse charging pinballer. I've seen Fuse take out Clev, so- Oh! My God! That was a double snipe! It was not planned, but it worked out beautifully. They didn't have a great opening, but they did it. They pulled off the shot. Wow, that was a really fast- Oh my God! The double snipe again! That was a double snipe! Was that a double snipe? Double snipe? That's being clipped. The odds there, you almost got a second kill. But Fuse is saying, no, I'm going in. I'm getting this. I'm getting this. Woo! Nice job, Fuse! Man, better DT player than myself, maybe. Uh, I saw him go up against Clev uh, in uh, UGL this weekend. Killer! Dude, Fuse, you're killing it! What would I do? If I was this team, I might just hold here, yeah, and get some free kills. And that was great foul shooting by Halsey. Dude, Falsey, you're kicking ass with the foul, bro. Oh, Cronides has no health, but Ghost doesn't know that! And Cronides goes in, balls a blazing, and gets the kill. Brand with the M10 kill! Weller with the P90 kill! But Loki coming up the back with the P90! Perfect gun for this situation! Oh no! Is his own kill gonna get it? Loki gets the kill! That's right, Loki! Good shit, man! Oh no, Darshay's coming in! She uh, Muffin had to go. Probably family stuff or something. Oh my gosh! Ghost goes in! Our aggro! And he gets- Oh, so close, Ghost! So close! Man! But the dollar comes in! Dollar! Yeah, man! Good stuff! Great job helping your team. That's why I say we fight together, we die together in Metro. He's waiting. Yes, he is. Colin the fifth is coming in, and he's coming in hard with his Matadors, which he's really good with. And here it goes for the cleanup! Oh, oh man! Get the sword! He got a sword kill! Got that shit! Good job, man! That was excellent! They are getting pressed by Team B. Colin is pushing them solo, and he takes one down with an RFB. You can do this, Weller. Collins is- Oh, God. They're, the others are putting pressure on him. He doesn't know Collins there. Oh, Colin with the RFB. Goodness. Close range. All right, everyone. Welcome to Game Over P1 Season 3, where we are going to have a good old action pack night with some good friends and good players. If you're not familiar with Go, Go has a variety of players. It has people from all the way from blue to diamond. And so you get a nice, healthy uh, spread of skill, which makes for some really interesting fights to shoutcast. All right, we are already gonna have action over here. Fuse shooting a Terminator, who's high in the sky, took some damage from the foul, almost 100 damage. Very nice shots, Fuse, with the foul. I think he only missed one or two shots there. Out of about six, so that was really good. No headshots it looked like, but very solid, good free damage. They, uh, Team E is unfortunately a duo because their third likely had uh, internet issues. But looks like uh, they're going to be A-OK. -okay. They're looting up Kingdom right now. And they are going to be cool. Uh, this trio is intent not to push them. So that's good news for them. Now, looking at the zone. Let's always look at this because we 
when we shower cast, yes, we talk a lot of smack because I'm friends with all these people. At least I like to believe so. But also we talk strategy, okay? So let's see what we got here. We got this frontier team who got real lucky with the drop. They don't quite know that no one's around them, or they might if they were watching the pods. And the good news is they got the drop. They have all this high ground they can rotate to. If they really had to, they could camp this out. But they're looking great. They have so many options to pin up and hold hard ground on. This team... These teams in Metropolis are most certainly going to have to either rotate hard or fight each other. And knowing them, they're not both not too keen on early fights. They like to loot up, get a full build, work together as a team. But in Metropolis, there's a lot of places to hide, so good chance they don't have to fight if they don't really want to. Interesting to see what will happen. But if I were this team, Team B, if I knew that team was low, either got to hold the high ground and drop on them, like stack on the high ground, drop on Team G uh, when they're split up like they are now. For example, Sammy's out here all on the side. Uh, but otherwise, it looks like they're still just happy looting, getting a full build. Hey, okay. Everyone's just playing the safe route. So now let's go to the other teams. We have a team at Tower, uh, which got here early which is a really good thing to do because they started here at outpost if you wait too long you're stuck in this dead zone okay this is dead zone no loot barely no cover right so they they were smart they rotated tower early very nice this team is rotating at least some of them are deciding to rotate fast that's good because if you get stuck here that's not good because this team can hold you uh surprisingly they're not shooting at that team who's just walking across the street dollar dogs check check it bro there he goes he's got his op out Let's get this shot, Dollar. Yeah, Dollar! Woo! Getting the shot. Cronides better rotate. Don't peek that way. He's got it up! Oh my god, he's... That's scary. Uh, Cronides, to cross that street, you gotta ride that bar on that arch there, buddy. You gotta ride this bar, like fly parallel to it, and get in this hard cover and roll into these houses and keep rotating. It looks like Team C is slowly advancing, just trying to hold zone. Team F has to move faster. If they want to be safe here because they're not in zone they got to get over to oh god they got to get over to pops chicken quickly uh, before it's too late uh dollar dogs is watching is shooting good build by loki great job cross the street Ooh, took some damage there not good gotta rotate faster oh chronides is stalling up too long he's gonna get stuck there when zone closes and it's not gonna be pretty uh, Cronides, uh, that is in zone technically, but you are split. But it looks like Team C did something crazy, and they decided to take lose their high hard ground and kind of go in the middle. So actually, Team F now has a better position on them because they have all this high ground that surrounds Team C. So if Cronides, for example, lays on some pressure, we got Showtime rotating on the left. It could work out if they just take their time and hit their shots. Good shots by Cronides. Uh, Halsey was really exposed. He was shooting a build there, but uh, he wasn't in the build. Good peeking by Ghost. Very nicely done. Terminator got a kill on Fuse with the DT-11. We're missing some action. But we might as well stick here. Muffin might have the other fight. Good grenade. Oh, M60. So dang close. Very nice try. Showtime. Oh, good shot with the RFB. Loki. Yep, good pressure from PMF. You know, I don't know if that was intentional. They rotate around these buildings. For example, they had one guy on this building and the other two over there. I don't know if it was intentional, but if it was, that was brilliant. Because Team C gave up their high ground over here, rotated to the low ground, and got caught in the middle of all this action here. So now, Team C really in a lot of trouble. Dollar Dog is all alone here. M60 is going to take him down. Halsey has got to run. Ghost has got to run. Or put up some good damage. Uh, but it looks like they're rotating. Unfortunately, zone really isn't working with them here. This is not going to work out. Team F just needs to press. Uh, Team F has all this pathway to zone. So they're looking great. Unfortunately, Team C is now in a bind. We got Ghost rotating over here. So he is trying to get in his zone. Uh, but it's going to look ugly because they got a team over here. There's not really a whole lot of loot unless they hit weapon shop. But I'm pretty sure that's already been looted. We got two of them in the tower. So hopefully there's some loot for them in there. Oh boy. They're going to be holding them at the tower here. Let's get a nice view here. Team F putting up good action on Team C. Dollar's going to die in zone, unfortunately. Good M60-ing. 
Showtime kicking butt with the M60 to this game. Oh, wow, they're dropping. Flying high in the sky for Ghost to get some free shots, and that was almost deadly. Uh, if Ghost was a little faster with that Magnum and perhaps a little more accurate with headshots, that would have been it for the, both of them. Uh, or just a little luckier. But now Ghost has the, the position, but he's holding all three. Can he do it? He's the last one on his team. He is a brave soul here. I don't know if I would even be doing this, but it's great. Just got to get some kills, get some damage in. Oh, Cronides has no health, but Ghost doesn't know that. And Cronides goes in, balls a-blazing, and gets the kill. Great job, Cronides. Beautiful work, Team F. They, they got some kills out of that. Great work. All right, let's rotate the action. Team A rotating up the hill. But there's there's a lot of action going down on there. Team G exposed. Team B holding the high ground. Team A rotating up. But, man, there's multiple fights going on here. John Harvey taking a lot of damage. Great high ground hold by Team B. Great accuracy as well from Pinballer and Weller. I, maybe I should give Brand some credit to there too. I think he hit his shots too. I'm bound to just missed it. <laughs> uh, good position. Now, uh-oh. Now they gave up their hard cover. See, and now I don't like this. Uh, Team B, if they just held this, held strong, they would have been good. They, they, they're... they're they're advanced, you know, they're moving back too far, allowing Team A to rotate on them now. We have Fuse coming up the side here. Don't rotate back. Hold hard. It's good to rotate and have an escape plan when you need it. But at sometimes you just have to hold your ground, get the damage on, and keep the pressure on. So now Team A has the pressure on Team B, uh, and there's no loot up there for Team B, so they're really going to be in trouble. Uh, team, for example, yo, good, good job rotating from Weller and Brand. They gotta go towards those houses for the hard cover and the loot. Baller, unfortunately, is holding this too hard, too long. Now that his other team just uh, led or fled. <laughs> now we got Fuse charging Pinballer. I've seen Fuse take out Clev. So, oh my God, that was a double snipe. Triple shot. On the wow, that was amazing. Good job, Brandon Weller. Good cover on Baller. That was not intended. That like that was not planned, but it worked out beautifully. They didn't have a great opening, but they. They did it. They pulled off the shot. Wow, that was a really fast. Oh my god, the double snipe again. That was a double snipe. Was that a double snipe? Double snipe? That's being clipped, y'all. That's being third clipped. Party. That was awesome. And a third party in the back by Team F, who has just been kicking it this game as well. They're going to get some great kills. They're moving strong. Good job, y'all. Some action going down here, but Team B also getting some sick shots, some sick plays. Pinball is holding the high ground really hard. He's saying, hey, I'll distract them. Yo, I'll op them, and it's working! It's really, oh, that wasn't a double op. That was an op and a magnum shot. That's what it was both those times, I think. Great work. Uh, great double shooting by these guys. I wonder if they're counting it down. Oh, no, Pinball went a little too hard. Uh, he should have probably backed out towards his team. Uh, unfortunately, now he's going to lose all his weapons, and there's probably not a lot left here. Uh, but otherwise, that was great fighting. Uh, Team F really did great rotating there. They are dominating up there, that zone positioning. We got Team D moving in finally. Took out Team... Oh, nope. Yep, Team D holding strong here. Where is Team G? Whoa, Team G rotated all the way around. They did a full circle around the map. Very interesting. Team, But Team D sees them. And Colin's got immaculate aim. He takes down Darshay with an RFB. WWWs killing WWWs. Just the way I like to see it. We got Team D now getting some hard pressure. It doesn't look like they have a lot of loot. They are getting pressed by Team B. Colin is pushing them solo. And he takes one down with an RFB. You can do this, Weller. Colin's in... Oh, God. They're, the others are putting pressure on him. He doesn't know Colin's there. Oh, Colin with the RFB. Goodness. Close range. He's lucky they didn't have DTs and we're ready for him. We're some kind of close range. Beautiful work on Colin's part, though. Great push and great support by his teammates. King Jerry almost dies in zone, but makes it in. Can Brand get the kill? You can do it, Brand. Oh, the fly out. A little dangerous. Oh, nice try, though. Nice try. Almost. They were pretty low. If he got two shots off there, that would have been it. Team F is still holding strong up here. Not a lot of loot, uh, but they're not getting a lot of aggro. Colin goes down to John Harpy camping with the Matadors. That's the way to camp. Good job. And they have all the loot. They get the loot. Gold up. Gold RFP. But oh, no. Showtime. Harpy with the Matadors. Harpy kicking ass with the Matadors. Beautiful work with the Matadors. Beautiful clutch by Harpy. Great work. 
Oh, the Kronats goes in! Shoot him! Oh my god, oh my god that was close, Harpy! <laughs> that was too close! Oh, oh my god, good job, Harpy! He clutches it again! Team G is still surviving! On no health, no anything, but can they do it? He's like a hermit crab. Team F! Really has nothing up there, no loot, they're gonna res, give some team some kills. Team G's probably got the best spot in the house now, but oh no, Ellie goes down! She didn't have any build, free kills! Shane's getting it, Loki's going in with the sword, can he do it? You can do it, Loki, you can do it! Oh, nice try, nice try, she was waiting for it, he had no health, if he had 200 health, that would have been it! Harpy with the Matadors! Oh, nice try, Harpy! Harpy, you had like six kills there with the Matadors, and you almost had Shay. Kinda good job, but Team G takes the win. Good job, job, Team G. You rotated hard there, and it worked out at the end. Very nicely done. Good game one. That was a great game one finish. High action, beautiful. Game two in the game over tournament. Let's have some good fun here. Uh, we are gonna kill the shoutcasters. All right, let's get to it. Game two on a classic map of game over tournament or competitive league, whatever you want to call it. We got one team dropping out to Cemetery. Very cool, very cool. A lot of loot for them. They're going to be in the clear, uh, way clear. So hopefully zone works in their favor. When you are a hot drop team in a competition, when the zone closes fast, you're, you're either in a really great shape or really crappy shape. Because uh, usually people pot out, so you're not going to get a lot of kills. Uh, and the, if the zone doesn't work with you, you're screwed. Because a lot of the times, man, it ends up on the opposite side of the map. You'd be surprised how often it happens. Uh, I don't know if that's like a thing. Uh, but let's see what we got here. No one dropping too... Oh, never mind. Wow. Look at that far shooting. I wonder if you got any damage. Too far for me to see. Playing aggro. Trying to show him who's boss early though. That works. So low, we got the zone here. So very interesting zone. So team B is in a great spot. Uh, they don't have to do anything they don't want to do. They can just hold the high ground. And they like to do that. So I'm assuming we'll see them holding some satellite dishes. So they can stay here or they can push to kingdom and hold this wall and know that this is relatively safe and looted. So that sometimes I like to do that. So if I know I'm in zone, I don't tell my team to stay. I tell them, say, let's rotate, push something hard where you can always retreat back if we have to. And we can loot up on the way. So we take all the loot. We hold another place and have a lot of extra. Loot. That's my strategy. So let's get to the teams in cemetery. Yes, because we are getting some action. Calling with the foul. Fighting. Teach John Harpy and Fuse. John Harple. <laughs> All right, let's see here. One shot, two shots with the foul by Colin the Fifth. Taking no major damage yet. Team G doesn't have a great spot here. They either had to push really hard, Team G, or they got to rotate hard that way. But Colin is not the kind of person to let them go. And I think they're just going to have to push this. Uh, and there's no loot for them, so it's really crappy. Uh, they pretty much have to go back, get as much shield sodas as they can and stuff like that, because they're they're really not in a good spot here. They haven't put much damage in Colin. King Jerry and Shark over there are fresh, as in they have 200 health. So they're rolling, they're rolling really strong right now, Team D. Uh, Team G should either push really hard and get in quick, or they got to just go back, loot up, and rotate hard zone. And just get out of here. Okay, ride the zone line. John Harpy's been putting a lot of pressure, but taking a lot of damage. I think he's out of shield. Oh, nope. He's got some shield shakers. Good. But he's likely going to be out after this. And Team D is full on pretty much everything now. Uh, so Team G's really got to be careful here. They can't play the out poke because Team D has so much to loot. Uh, so they really have to go hard here. Or just push him away and... But I mean, it's so far, it's relatively even trade, but Team G just has less loot than Team D. So it's going to not go in their favor eventually if they play it like this. Unless they get a lucky good kill on one of the teammates, particularly if they take down Colin. Fuse, an excellent player. Great peeking with the foul here. A nice tight peek. Well, not, not very tight, but he's, he's peeking and it's looking relatively effective. Hasn't taken much damage yet at all. Putting down good pressure. 
You know, if anything, the foul might not be great at getting kills, but it's great at putting out pressure, as in scaring people so that they move back. Like, Team D moved back. Let's be real here. Team G did fantastic because they were able to get into zone, period, okay? Team D did not have to let these people into zone. Uh, but for whatever reason, it really felt like Colin was the only one shooting at all of Team G. Like, I didn't really see King Jerry and Shark shooting at Team G a lot. Uh, if if Shark and Jerry were shooting at Team G more, I think these people would not have been able to hold, get into the zone. Like, they, they did really well, Team G. They were able to get into zone. Now, Team D is in a pickle here because Team B is going to come up behind them. And I would have said that to my team. I said, we got to hold this <laughs> this team and we got to wipe them quick because we know a team's an observatory and they're going to come up and third party us. And they are. Good job, Team B. That's exactly what you should have done. All you got to do is hold your position. Zone worked in your favor. Good lord, that was perfect zonage for them, uh, Team B. They rotated really well. It's like they knew where zone was going to be. Uh, but beautiful. So now, Team D was lucky, actually. They rotated out. Uh, if I was Team B, if I was trying to be more aggressive, I would have, you know, had spread out maybe. Would have had one person or two here. And then one over here. Uh, but... I, I think Team B is more just like the let's hold this position and get some kills and just hold. All right, and I think that's what they're trying to do. It's not working out really effective because Colin uh, and, and Team D are essentially now rotating around them. Oh my god, do you see this, everyone? What happened here? Team D said, whoa, they're, we're getting third party. Let's rotate out. We, they fight us, they fight us. They rotated out. They came around. So now that who's getting third party? Team B's getting third party. But the good news is Team B is doing really good against holding Team G because they didn't really have a lot of loot. Uh, so, oh, man, if I was Team B, what would I say? I would say Pinballer. I, if I was Pinballer, I would say, yo, Bran Weller, help me get over here and kill Team G. They're on health. Like, I've been doing a great job poking, but I need your help. I'm solo. This is the second time this has happened. Pinballer doing his own thing and then the other two doing their tight thing. Uh, I wonder what's going on in comms over there. Uh, but it's not working out because... He's about to get smashed. Fuse takes the kill, though, with the foul. Now Team D is like, okay, one on Team B is down. Let's push on them. So they're now the ones squeezing. Uh, so while Team B had the good ground, uh, I think they have to pick their spots and hold their spots. You all do great rotating. And you, you do pick good spots, but you have to hold it. Sometimes you just got to hold and fight. And sometimes fight to the death. Because otherwise you end up rotating into a worse position. But they are in zone, so they can camp it out, and that's cool. And if someone dares walk into that building, they might get a free kill. And tides could change. Who knows? Uh, so they're, they're, Team B is doing really well right here, okay? Uh, this is probably what you got to do. You probably just have to camp this and pray someone walks in for a death. Okay, so now we got Team D shooting Team G. Oh, my God. Team A came up out of nowhere. I should have been watching. Oh, my God. They rotated up behind Team G, who was already hurt. Dude. Hey, get your shield up. You haven't fought anybody else yet. You should be full. Drink some sodas. You should have sodas, not shakers. Not too many shakers, I hope. Yeah, shield up. Great job smushing Team G there. Wow, that, that was that was fantastic. Uh, great job. I don't even know where they came from. Sneaky girls. Uh, very nice. Very nice. Now they have the high ground. Colin saying, I'm going to push all of them myself. Nope. He changed his mind. He heard the footsteps and said, nope. Not going to do that. Uh, it doesn't look like they have a lot of loot because this building has been looted like four times over by different teams. Uh, so it's going to be really interesting what Team A does here because they really don't have a lot. Uh, team D is saying, hey, let's push this. They can't have a lot of loot. Uh, they, we looted that. <laughs> I hope they're saying that. That would be smart. But there are bananas under the building. I hope they know that. They must. Just not a lot of shield. Team D is saying, no, we can take them. Let's do it. Let's rotate out because we know there's only one team here. Let's rotate on them. Shark, unfortunately, took a lot of damage. Team A is still holding strong. Good job, Sammy, on the side shots. WWW versus WWW. Colin with a great peek on Darth Shea. With the Sako shots. He's saying the Sako is still usable as long as you peek with it. And I'm sure it is. I'm sure you would rather have a man. Oh, my God. That was a Sammy. That's, that's my girl. Beautiful grenade. Great damn work. Oh my god, who is this girl? Who is this girl? I don't know who that is. Because that's not the Sammy I used to play with. What the fuck? She just dominated Colin and his team. Holy shit. Oh my god, that was amazing. Holy fucking shit. He's having an aneurysm. <laughs> he, I'm sure he is. 
Holy Drum shit. And oh, I'm having an answer. Yes, I am. Uh, Team B did it. They capped it. And I missed it. They capped it. It got the kill. Great work. Oh, my God. I didn't, I missed it. I hope Muffin, my boy, got that fight because I was, I was really waiting for it. I was going to see if it worked, and it did. Team F has got a strong position here. If they hold this wall, honestly, yeah, yeah, rotate the wall. That's right. Rotate it. Peek it. They are a duo. I hope you know that. All you got to look for is the wolf, and you know that's a duo. Uh, that's what happens when you wear a unique skin. Oh, Loki's going in. Balls in. Going hard. Oh, he didn't have a close range weapon, but it didn't matter. It's a duo, so they have this. They have this. Great job, Team F. That's right. That's what happens when you fight as a duo, unfortunately. And you just, it, it is what it is. Uh, good job, Team F. Y'all have been kicking at this lobby. Uh, and Team A has as well. Let's see what happens here. Team B uh, somehow came back when they were getting squeezed. They hid, and it worked out. Sometimes being sneaky and being quiet is the best thing to do. And I need to learn that because I'm just like, hey, let's charge always. Uh, so, you know, sometimes sneaky is best. Darshay getting some ripping RB shots over there, but Baller saying, hey, that gun doesn't do shit to build, and he knows it. Uh, good job on the build. He's being patient. He split again. He loves being solo. I, I know him. He loves playing by himself. I get it. But oh my god, Team A got the drop. So lucky because I know they didn't have a lot of stuff there. Uh, team the, the team they killed, the other WW team, didn't have a whole lot of loot because they were fighting the whole game. Uh, so now, Team F fighting Team B. Brand with this M10 kill, Weller with the P90 kill, but Loki coming up the back with the P90, perfect gun for this situation. Oh no, it's his own kill, gonna get it. Loki gets the kill. That's right, Loki. Good shit, man. Oh no, Darshay's yeah, coming in. She... Over the top. Oh, if he oh. saw it, if he was just looking down and firing down, Loki would have had that. If I had any advice to you, Loki, I'd say great fucking work. Uh, when you go in for the close range, work on your vertical, as in you're down and up. Because, man, you were kicking ass there. But if you were looking down in both those fights you died in, uh, you would have had those, honestly. Look down and up when you're in close range. Get him, Ellie. All man, right. Move, we man. got Team B and A here. Oh, God, it's Baller versus the three. Can he do it? <laughs> I would be very impressed and very surprised because uh, Team A is a really strong team. Uh, they're like, where the hell is this guy? This guy is a ninja. <laughs> they have no clue. <laughs> Do they really have no clue? Or they're just saying, forget it. Like, we ain't going to go in there if he has a sword. I think they're just I don't eliminating know. options. Yeah, I don't think she knows. They probably know. I think Sammy's about what to figure it out right now. Did she hear it? Hear she now. didn't hear it. She's on Quest 2 Native, so she didn't hear it. Yeah. Oh, he's boy. Just gonna, he's just gonna, he's gonna he's burn. Just gonna I think he's gonna let it happen, and I think that's a good thing to do. I, I think that's actually a okay. Yeah, he probably got a couple placement points there, so that, that was smart. Better than rezzing there and giving them three kills, so. Great work, Team A. That is the second win from Team A. WWW girls kicking ass. All right, game three of Game Over Tournament here. We are getting to some action. It's been a good heated first two games. Uh, the WWW Cowgirls have been just been kicking ass. Uh, their rotations have been spot on. Uh, I wonder if that was Sammy making the calls because Sammy and I used to play together, so she knows how to rotate. Uh, but Sammy was beast in that round. She totally carried that game, taking out Colin's team. That was fantastic. Let's see what happens here. Metro is getting some action. Oh my god, Team F's going down. Team D dropped right next to Team F. Team A also in the same position, but they're a duo. Holy crap. They just said, hey, let's hot drop on this. And I think a lot of teams are going to pay for that. Uh... Oh, bummer. This will be uh, Team F's drop game, that's for sure. It's okay, because they had two awesome games so far, so that's okay. Uh, but, yeah, a lot of action going down in apartments. Said, I have to sadly get up, and my recording keeps crashing, so I don't think I can sadly. No problem, Muffin. It's okay. Uh, I got it. But thanks anyways. Uh, you're welcome to try again anytime in the future. Very cool. All right, we got Khan and Shark rotating on the hard cover. That was beautiful. That's exactly how you got to do it because you, when you rotate on this wall, you just peek the wall, and the enemy can't do anything if they're over here, right? That was beautiful rotation. That person was stuck there. There wasn't much he could do. Dark Shade, uh, Team E over here. Where is her team? Where is her team? I'm Daryl Man. Something happened here. Said Shade. I'll send the herself. recording I have. 
Okay, sure, yeah, I think I missed a fight in that first game, so that would be cool. Wow, they're really split up. Must have been an accidental drop, or she just said, oh, I want to try and get in on this action. That's probably what happened. Um, cool. Being a boss, Shay. Shay, an excellent player. Kicks ass so and mixed doubles and, and also arcs, so very cool. Uh, looks like she's going to aggro. But we do have the duo, Team A, over here. Uh, w with Team D. Hopefully, Team D doesn't hunt them down, and I think they are. Uh, so, Team D's, Team A's got to rotate. Uh, I know Team A. Jackie's awesome with rotations, but he's usually doing it with a team of three, and the way he rotates is more of like a, we're going to hold this position, fight out this position, and rotate when it's going sour. But I think in this situation as dual, you got to rotate hard and rotate fast. There's too much ground walking going on from Team A. They're going to be in trouble once Team D gets close. Uh, and Team D is getting very close. Once Team D hears them, that's pretty much going to be game over for them unless they hold tight and get some nice close-range uh, kills on Team A. Or Team D, sorry. Ah, uh, yep, here it goes. Let's hang here for this fight. It doesn't look like we have any more action going on. They know they're in the weapon shop. They said, hey, let's hold this. I know Jackie likes the weapon shop, so let's see what they do here. Very interesting. So let's watch Jackie's view. He's holding the corner here. we got Colin coming outside. Oh, we got King Jerry one way. Colin going in this way with an RFB. He loves that RFB. I, I hate the RFB. Good peeking by King Jerry. Good action. Oh, my goodness. Great team. Oh, nice try by Jackie there. He almost got the kill on King Jerry. I think if uh, if, if Jackie was peeking there, he would have got the king, kill on King Jerry or put some build up to block this door. Uh, if Yeah, if I were him, I would have put a bunch of build to block this door and spam it while he was ground walking and then switch to guns to kill Jerry. Uh, but that was a nice attempt. Uh, as a duo, but good job for Team D. Okay, we've got Team G here, chilling in planes wide by themselves. Very interesting. I think the next fight's going to be over here. We have Team E, who's been kicking it with rotations. They've been kind of rotating late into zone. Ooh, and, and they've been rotating the zone edge, uh, which works out when it works out, but when a team holds you, then you're in trouble, and I think this is where they are going to be in trouble. Let's see how they do this. Zone isn't hitting hard yet, but it's about to right now. Uh, and Team C, I don't think is going to let them go. Good kill by Dollar Dogs. We'll rotate with Sammy. Good rotation. She's got a sword. Team C's holding the line, though, and that's really all they have to do. They're praying that Team C gets third-partied, and Team C is going to get third-partied, everybody. Uh, it's going to happen. Do you see Team G flying up behind? We're going to get over there once Sammy gets in the clear, which she looks like she's going to because Team G just saved them. They got so lucky. They were totally banking on that, and I know them. Uh, they were saying, let's rotate and pray someone third parties, Team C, and they were so lucky because Team G is an aggressive team, and they said, yeah, let's third party. Uh, so they're going in. Uh, let's see what happens now. Team C is in a bind, and that's what happens when you are holding some, a team at zone. Whenever I'm holding a team at zone, I tell my team, okay, hey, we're going to hold this damn team, but you got to watch our back. Someone has to be watching our back at all times because we are risking getting held in zone, and what happened? Now Team C is in the shitter. Uh, team C, though, Ghost going in and saying, no, we got to push this. Let's get out of this. One-on-one, -on -one, Fuse versus Ghost. Ghost, Fuse takes him down. Or half alive takes Ghost down, sorry. Dollar Dog's not doing good on health here. He hit, looks like he drank a couple shield soda, uh, health sodas. Half alive going in for the kill behind. Dollar Dog's didn't see it or hear it. It's kind of hard to hear when you're in zone, especially when you're on Quest 2 native. <laughs> I'm going to be dissing Quest 2 native all night. Uh, team G, but good job on Team G. Uh, pushing out Team C. But now guess what? They're the ones getting third partied. <laughs> so what do I say? If anyone, if anyone rewatches the stream and you learn anything from tonight's stream, that really is a really good thing to learn. Colin's coming in for the kill. Great Matador play by Colin Ariel. Let's see how this goes out before I go over the lesson. Colin really hard in zone. I'm sure he's got plenty of health. But guess what? Team D lost one. How did how did Shard go down? I don't even know. I wasn't paying attention. But good kill. Colin's holding strong in zone though, but he doesn't panic. It's gonna be really interesting to see what happens. Brand go gets an op kill on Sammy. 
who is not making it out of his own rotation. We got some heavy fighting going down. I don't know what to watch. <laughs> it's kind of everywhere right now. Colin went a little too hard. His team wasn't able to hold that their position. So now it's going down. But he's not panicking. He's saying, no, I'm going to fight this out. Now half alive is in trouble. Colin gets the kill, but I don't think he has enough health to make it to zone. I know he doesn't have enough health to make it to zone. So he's in trouble. He's shouting a shark to say, shark, you better live this because I'm about to die. At least he better be saying that. Uh, Team E made it into zone. Great rotation, Team E. I am going to be so shocked if they win this again. <laughs> That's, they, they're rotating the zone line the whole time, and it's working. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure I taught Sammy that, and she's, she's kicking ass at it. Uh, or they are kicking ass at it. Uh, great work. Um, Team B now always holding a great position to start. Like They know how to choose their positions. They really do. Uh, great stuff. Hold this. Don't lose it. Don't let a team rotate you out of it and rotate you in a worse position. You're holding a nice, strong position here. We got a lot of fighting going down, though. Thank me. Team D rotating in, trying not to die. Oh, my God, Shark. Oh, Shay has totally spotted him. Shay is just watching this. She's saying this is a free-ass kill, and it is a free kill. Good job, Shay. Y'all were in a terrible position, but you made it into zone. You're still riding the line still, but it's working out. Uh, good rotations. Uh, don't hang in zone too long. We've seen what happens to teams that do that that have done that the lesson in the collins making it out of zone uh great looting great flying but if you've learned anything from watching this stream over or this recording over it's that when you are holding a team at zone you always have to watch your back and get ready to rotate have an escape plan to rotate out just in case you get third party because it's likely going to happen in comp good kill by vip ace gets uh star shade with the ump a lot of shotgun action Great work by Team C. They're, they're sticking together. Are they going to make it out of zone? I don't think so. Zone's really far and ticking really hard, whereas Team E is rotating it safely. They said, Shay said, hey, I'm going to go and try to get the kills. And she did. I wonder if she hit all those people enough to get all those kills. Because if she did, that's a lot of kills. I'm going to ask them after this game. Uh, if she tapped each of them, that's three kills. That's all she had to do. And I think that was intentional. That was very smart. Team B, meanwhile, holding strong, getting the kill on Colin while he was rotating in zone it was unfortunate because colin did an amazing rotation back to zone I, I thought he was certainly dead he was able to rotate and get some health great flying good job uh team b holding the, the hard ground and the best ground they haven't had really any kills this whole game though uh they, i think they only have two so but a win and two kills is still okay uh so yeah let's see what they do can they pull it off team e doesn't have really any loot uh baller it's got an rfb I wish he had an M60, because then they'd, uh, Team E would really be in trouble. But, oh boy, I don't think there is much getting out of this for Team E. Oh boy, yeah, not even enough loot to make it really uh, into zone. No loot. Unfortunately, uh, Team E is finally going to go down here. Uh, but it might have been a... Oh, good grenade. Good grenade. Good grenade. And they were fresh. They had 200 health, each of them. They had many, plenty of grenades. There was really not much Team E could do there. They were holding that zone really, really hard. Good job, Team B. Very nicely done. And good job, Team E, too. Very nice. From Metropolis, there's two games. Uh, so we got to make sure we don't miss this action. All right. Oh, we're going to have action quickly. We always do. All right. Team A here. Looks like Team B. Oh, Team B is just solo. He's going to be okay. This is probably the best place to play solo because there's plenty of places to hide for him. Definitely spots to get kills. Oh, boy. Team D getting free kills on Team F. Uh, this is a really hard position for Team F. And I hope they just keep rotating. Oh, God. It, it's going to be hard. Uh, you got Oh, man. This is really bad. Really bad. They got to go. And they all got to move at probably the same time. Yeah, yeah. This is good. It's really good. Go showtime. Yeah, Showtime! You got this, buddy! Keep going down this wall! Yes! Yes! Cronite just has to stall. Uh, but Team D is getting some great, easy kills here. Uh, that's the problem with dropping at slums. Uh, when I'm Team F, I always say, we're going to drop hard, drop quick. You don't dare fly in the air. Ride your pod to the ground. Loot up and ride this. Ride this down because there's usually a team that goes up there, right? And a team at apartments. So I ride out of there ASAP. But it looks like Showtime is kicking ass right here. Great job, Showtime. You did good. You did exactly what you needed to do. Oh, no. Don't move. Stop. Just stop moving. Stop moving. Stop. Fuck. 
his foot slipping out. Don't, oh shit. Shit, well, I see his foot. Showtime, dude, get that foot fucking higher, bro. Oh, Showtime, you did so good on the rotation. You did really good. Props to you there. Weller knows. Ah, oh, they see him, they see him. Nice try, buddy. Uh, there was not anything you could do there. Um, you just unfortunate you rotated into another team. Uh, but it was a great lead from the other fight. Not much you can do there. That's just a crappy situation. All right, we got fighting. Darche getting some long distance shots on Team G. Oh my God, Team C is in the open. Get down and inside. Get low, get low. They wanted that kill on Team that the solo player, but they're getting shot. You better, oh my God, Fuse is flying in the air. No one is capitalizing. Uh, so tip to everyone, you know, keep your eyes up. Uh, always up. You never know when someone's gonna do some crazy flying. Ooh, a lot of misses with the foul there by Shay. Ghosts are pretty open, but she got some there. Uh, definitely need to work on the foul a little bit there. That was quite a bit of misses. That might have been like 40% hit rate. She's gonna rotate out. Gonna be very interesting to see how Team E does this. Sammy knows how to rotate in Metro. Her and I have done hundreds of Metro games together. It's gonna be very interesting to see what happens. Team C rotating into Weapon Shop now. Good choice. Good spot to be in. All right, so we've got people spread out, just trying to get a nice spot in zone right now. Uh, so we're not going to see a whole lot of action yet. This is going to be a really weird zone. Oh, boy. What would I do? If I was this team, I might just hold here. Yeah, and get some free kills. And that was great foul shooting by Halsey. Dude, Falsey, you're kicking ass with the foul, bro. That was awesome. Better shooting with me than me with the foul. Ooh, if, if Halsey was watching that, that would have been free kill. Good job, Halsey and Ghost, I believe, or was it Dollar, sorry, uh, with the, the shots there. You almost got a second kill, but Fuse is saying, no, I'm going in. I'm getting this. I'm getting this. Woo. Nice job, Fuse. Man, better DT player than myself, maybe. Uh, I saw him go up against Clev uh, in uh, UGL this weekend. Killer. Dude, Fuse, you're killing it. Uh, I missed so many shots with the DTs, dude. Maybe I'm just firing too fast. Uh, but good job, Fuse. Went in there and cleaned up shot. Uh, team A now dropping on Team C. Going in hard. Oh, no. Weller's stuck between two. Where is his team? Brand, shoot him. Oh, Brand. That took too long. I think he had a weapon switch issue there. You would have had that, Brand. I think he had a weapon issue. Oh, man. If Baller was there, Baller would have had that. They would have had dollar at least, and then he could have got out of there. Oh my god! They do an interesting kind of a strategy. They they always split, uh, and Metro particularly I I stack. Show casting. This is yeah, in Metro I say stack. We we fight together, we die together. Yeah, a shell casting. Sammy, I got you, Austin Beast and Colin there earlier. Uh, oh my god! I know that was Yeah, so I got cool. that. that yeah. was a one star That's gonna be highlighted. That's gonna be clipped. That that was too good. That was too good. Yeah. Let's go, I think I like killed him Let's before go. I like squad wiped his team. Too. Yeah, that was beautiful. I saw it. I'll send you my footage. What game was it? Two. I I'm gonna put this up tonight. I know you. I'm getting that next week if you dare send that no, to me. No, I'm I'm pretty proud of that. <laughs> I'm pretty proud of it. <laughs> okay, you better send it like in an, in an hour and an hour. I'm gonna be editing know. this like these people want this up okay. quick. Uh, right. Okay, it's Team C holding the nice strong position. Oh, baller in a terrible position. Oh, That's yeah, why in yeah. Metro um, I say you I, fight I, together, I you die year. together. Okay. You don't split you unless it's the first zone. Post them. Either whatever works. I don't care. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'll probably, Let's if see. I have all. Of if you have all of them, you can just post That's them. That's okay. But it's like yeah. a time limit. All right. Good close range fighting. Team G is killing it this round. Man, they have like six kills this round. Go Team G. They're starting to put their things together. They've had a couple good games already though. Where is Muffin Mancaster number two at? Muffin had to go. Probably family stuff or something. Oh my gosh. Ghost goes in on aggro. And he gets... Oh, so close, Ghost! So close! Man, but the dollar comes in! Dollar! Yeah, man! Good stuff! Great job helping your team! That's why I say we fight together, we die together in Metro. Memorize that shit! Good job, team! Colin heard that. He's waiting. Yes, he is! Colin the fifth is coming in! And he's coming in hard with his Matadors, which he's really good with! And here it goes for the cleanup! Oh, man! Get the sword! He got a sword kill! 
got that shit. Good job, man. That was excellent. You did what you had to do in a situation like that. There's no escaping. Just get a kill, and you got a kill. That was fantastic. Beautiful action. We clipping that. We clipping that. Pretty weak. That was awesome. <laughs> All right, we got Brandon Weller. Oh my God, they got nothing. And that is why you fight together, you die together. I'm saying it four times because people got to memorize it. Uh, in Metro, you can't do that in the second to, second to last zone because the zone is just too small and everyone has looted everything already. Oh, so if you res your people, easy. unless you got a bunch of loot nearby, you're really just in trouble and you're getting given more kills. Uh, but yeah, if they were fighting, if that team was fighting together earlier, y'all would have had a really uh, better shot there and probably at yeah, least another kill. All right, good job, Team D, though. Strong play, going in for some nice cleanup. Very nicely done. Droppers going on. Let's get to it. Interesting, he carries sword as well as Maddie's. Oh, I, I don't know if he carries it at the same time. He, he might, because, uh, he, yeah, he's excellent with the sword. He's killed me too many times with the sword. Uh, yeah, I mean, he's one of the best players out there, but he's excellent with the sword and Matadors, but sword he's better at with than his Matadors. All right, so we got one down, two down already. We got a res. Oh, crap. Fuse hears it, and Fuse is an aggro player. He's going for it. Oh, no, no, he's not. He's not going to charge with the M60. He's being a little careful. Oh, good peek on him. Dang, Halsey. That was great A peeking, buddy. Good job, Halsey, with the rural ping. Great peeking, but he's getting shot by Darche a mile away, but he's gonna be okay. Good build. Fouls are great, but they do nothing against build. Oh my gosh, Team G, the aggro team, going at Dollar Dog. Good job, John Harpy, with his Matadors. Uh, Harple, you've been doing great with his Matadors, John. Uh, good stuff as well, this, uh, this whole Go lobby. Very nice. A lot of Matador play, I see. I, you know, as I see everyone playing comp a lot of these days, I see a lot more Matadors. It just, it, it is more consistent than the DT. It really just is. Uh, but DT is better, sure, at high level if you can use it at a high level. But there's only like a handful of people who can do that effectively. I even screw up and lose games because I miss the DT shots. Uh, so, tough to use. Team D now, not in the greatest position. Uh, but the good news is they have a lot to loot and a lot of time to loot. They can loot all the slums and they're A-OK. -okay, and I don't think this has been looted. Uh, so, yeah, I think they're going to be all right. Oh, no. Let's hope Colin doesn't hear that because you know if he hears it, he's going to go for it. Uh, he's peeking. He's looking. Oh, no. Okay, they're saying, hey, let's just keep him off us by shooting at him. I guess that's going to work because he wasn't giving up. Uh, I pretty, I think you pretty much have to do that at that point. Oh boy, yeah, an aggressive player like that, uh, it's gonna be very hard to hold. Oh, he's flying in the air. Yes. Oh man, almost. If they killed him there, that would have changed the tide of the battle. Uh, they would have had enough time to escape because Colin is the aggro player on that team A, the team and the leader. Uh, if he went down, they would have just regrouped. Uh, so that was so close for Team D. Uh, but now they're really in trouble, but they have a lot of time to still fly and rotate. They're doing the split thing again. I'm not a fan of that, uh, but this is the first zone, so it could work, okay? Uh, we won't watch this too long. Let's watch some other action. Team G always getting some action, and I missed it. Oh, no! Team G's getting some pressure. Up high? No, he's good. He's good. But the problem is there isn't a lot of loot. Ah, oh, crap. I would try to pick up some stuff for his team. Oh boy, there's really no loot in here. They should put loot here. Like, they should. Because uh, it's just a dead zone without loot. But it's a nice place to be if there was loot. Uh, they're going to res here. Oh god, if Team F hears this. Uh, we got a lot of action going down that I'm missing. Sammy going with the P90. Ghost going in the Matadors, but so did Shay. And Shay is great with those Matadors. She killed me in mixed doubles a few days ago. Uh, I, those must have been gold when she killed me with them. I had a DT. I missed my shots. Great job, Shay, with Matadors. Okay, I thought she was shooting someone there. Uh, they're good. They're going to be A-OK. -okay. They got plenty of loot. Team D is back alive. And it looks like oh, one's down because they did that split. But hopefully that split appeased Team A of their bloodlust for now. Uh, so, and it looks like it did. So they're going to be okay. They might have time to res and loot here. So that's good. 
very good for them. Uh, they might be okay. They, they'll have loot, but it's not going to be the best loot. Team G was in a horrible position, as we know. But it looks like they're getting to a great spot. Good job, Half-Life. Good build. Good rotation. Yep, he's meeting up with Fuse in this building. It looks like they are in zone. So great work, Team G. Dude, good job. Uh, they were in a crappy spot. They made it into a great building. This building you can hold really well because there's a lot of places to peek and rotate with peek. You can hide behind this, peek this, rotate here, peek, just build a couple, peek, and you can essentially evade a zone grenade or a grenade. So it's awesome. Uh, this is a great building if you have to make a final stand. Team A is in apartments. They've been doing great here. I mean, there's so much loot in apartments. Why give it up, right? Uh, team D is up here at the very top. We've got, oh, we've got, oh boy, two teams here in the, in the market. How is it going to go down? Good kill by Sammy with the P90. Kronach flies in. Oh no, but he's getting shot by Shay. Now he's in trouble because she's got Matadors. Good backup. Showtime. Showtime saved his life. Great job, Showtime. Oh no! P not Sammy with their P90, but Fuse comes up in the back with the DT. Fuse has been killing it with the DT today. Great job, Fuse, with your DT. I might even say your DT is better than my DT right now. Good shit, Fuse. Uh, I'm giving you DT when we play together in a couple days. Good stuff. Oh, Shay comes in with the Matadors, but she misses a lot of shots there. What happened? I wonder if that was a glitch or something. It looks like she was having trouble. I, I don't know what it was. Uh, she was shooting at nothing, or he was somehow building, and I didn't see it. But, oh boy, bummer for the WWW girls. Uh, Team G, though, really came out of a crappy spot to getting in and getting aggro and getting more kills. Man, they probably have like seven, eight kills this game. Good job, Lines Team G. One, two, three, Good four, job, five. Team G. A weird Seven. zone here. She ran out of ammo. Ran out of Good ammo. Day. There you she go. Like Good eye. Oh, yeah, that was unfortunate, okay. man. Um, that happens, though, with the Matadors uh, and the Uzi a lot, though, doesn't it? Oh, and that is an game. issue with the guns. Know. You wouldn't think oh, it is, okay. right? Is it only but it really is in comp. Yeah. Uh, now, this is an interesting uh, Wait, battle we got here. We got one team on the high ground, one team on the low ground. And it looks like, whoa, what a zone we have. Look at this zone. <laughs> Unfortunately, Team A just had so much time to get into the wonderful position, but it's really going to be interesting to see how Team G does this. You pretty much have to build out. You don't have a great spot to do it. Oh, God. Oh, Fuse is saying, I'm going to rotate hard on the outside. Is it going to work? He had a lot of health. He might be able to do it. Fuse is a hero. Fuse is a hero. Can he do it? They're saying, at the same time, let's go. And he threw a grenade to get some pressure relieved. He's buying some time to sh Oh no, he's, the rest of his team's too slow! Too slow! Oh, Fuse! No! Nice try, Fuse, though. It was a brilliant play. It just, team, the, the others just waited too long. That, that's really all that happened there. It, that was actually a brilliant play. He had enough health to do it, but the other two didn't uh, go up at the right time. They just charged full up. They might have gotten a kill on one of the enemy team that was flying, but I'm pretty sure it's time to clean up shop now for Team A. He's got his Matadors, though. Harpy's been doing some work. Can he get it? He got a kill. Good job, Harple. Man, John's been really kicking it with Matadors this uh, lobby. And here goes the Floss, the most toxic player of WWW. Colin uh, got dethroned as the most toxic player. Now we have King Jerry, most toxic 